Hello everyone, today we're going to talk about the massacre of Ramry Island. The Battle of Ramry Island was fought in January and February 1945 during the Second World War as a part of the 15 Indian Corps offensive on the Southern Front in the Burma campaign. The island had been captured by the Imperial Japanese Army in early 1942, along with the rest of Southern Burma. In January 1945, the Allies launched an attack to retake Ramri and its neighbor Cheduba Island to establish air bases on the island for the supply of the mainland campaign. When the British outflanked a Japanese stronghold, the 900 defenders abandoned the base and marched to join a larger battalion of Japanese soldiers across the island. The route took the Japanese through 10 miles of mangrove swamp, and as they struggled through it, the British encircled the area. Trapped in deep, mud-filled land, tropical diseases soon started to afflict the soldiers, as did scorpions, tropical mosquitoes, and saltwater crocodiles. Some British soldiers who participated in the battle claimed that the large population of saltwater crocodiles native to the mangrove swamps on Ramri Island preyed on the trapped Japanese force at night and ate many soldiers. Bruce Wright gave a description of the event. That night was the most horrible that any member of the mother launch crews ever experienced. The scattered rifle shoots in the pitch black swamp punctured by the screams of wounded men crushed in the jaws of huge reptiles and the blood worrying sound of spinning crocodiles made a cacophony of hell that has rarely been duplicated on earth. At dawn the bolters arrived to clean up what the crocodiles had left of about 1000 Japanese soldiers that entered the swamps of Ramri only about 20 were found alive. Lieutenant General G.F.R. Jacob recounted his experience during the battle. Over 1,000 soldiers of the Japanese garrison retreated into the crocodile-infest mangrove swamps. We went in with boats and interpreters using load hailers asking them to come out. Not a single one did. Saltwater crocodiles, some of them well over 20 feet in length, frequented these waters. It is not difficult to imagine what happened to the Japanese who took refuge in the mangroves.